while I was studying in Delhi, I was seeing a lot of good hotels going around. And as I am a foodie, so I was thinking, why not have a good hotel in Bhubaneswar? So that's the time when I decided to have the first property at Bhubaneswar after my graduation. And the first money which um, came to me was from my mother. It was a loan of rupees one lakh. We have a lot of open space, a lot of public areas and uh, big space for banquets, meetings, conferences, exhibitions. Each hall has a big lawn in front of the banquet hall. So we have gone, gone up vertically. One hall, there is a lawn, vertically up again, hall and lawn, hall and lawn. So that's how this project has been conceived. So we can do three weddings at a time and we've already had two medical conferences of 700-800 uh, people. We have already uh, purchased land in in Satpada, in Betar Kanika, and we are planning to get a land in Satkusia. All these places are very exotic destinations in forest area. So we will get special permission approved and do projects which are eco-friendly and in these forest areas because people want to be far from the madding crowd. When we planned the resort, there was nothing in that area. There, there was not even a road connecting to that land. So we approached the government. We first purchased the land and then approached the government with our plans that that road is connectivity is required. Government was kind enough at that time to connect, to, to make a road connectivity to that land. And uh, when we started the project, the entire village was opposing. And slowly they became the villagers became the daily laborers and they became, uh, after opening the hotel, they are part of the hotel and they are working in the hotel after we have trained them from Sims in hospitality. Mm -hmm.